Hi folks, Toad Hancock's here with Visor Down and I am sat with TT Zero winner, Mr. Michael Rutter. Thank you. How does that feel? Glad to get out of the way, you yeah. know, um, to, um, to, especially with John McGuinness in the team behind me. I know he was desperate, doing anything to beat me. So uh, we, we've got a bit of luck on our side because we've had a good week, good build up to it. I think John's had a few problems struggling um, with a few uh, setups with his bikes and I've been on, you know, a bit of a crest of a wave with some good, good, uh, good finishes in the Super Art race and Super Twin race. So, yeah, we went into it, and uh, I tried hard, you know. I, um, I didn't have anything left, you know. If he'd have beat me, I'd, I'd have uh, definitely patted him on the back. Good, good. And you, you were talking earlier on. I heard you talking about that you had some, some sort of uh, troubles with the bike over some of the crests you were sliding the back end around. Yeah, well, Tell us about that. Yeah, basically went off the line and down uh, Braille into Quarter Bridge and I, I thought, right, just, I just lashed the power on and it just spun up on me, you know. It was a nice slide, but I mean, it was just, oh, wow, like, be careful next time. Right. So, um, you know, and did a few other places just uh, um, uh, just off to the mountain mile and that just uh, started spinning a bit. But, you know, the bike was faultless, mm -hmm. but, um, a bit unstable in a few places where um, I think we've gone a bit too soft with it and we could have um, made the, the suspension a bit better uh, but we only had two laps and you just don't know every time you go a little bit quicker you learn a bit more mm -hmm. and to get the lap record it was um, it was brilliant to uh, uh, go over the line and uh, complete that lap. Awesome so I mean we've had a really a bit of a sticky week with regards to running so that have, hasn't been as much running in previous years just now the temperature has really really dropped do you think that spinning up and the sliding about it could have just been down to lack of rubber in a cold track exactly there's no rubber down compared to last year it's mm. there's zero rubber compared down to you know it's a it was like a proper racetrack last year right um it's very green and uh it, I, I think you know it, it didn't help the the um the, the tt zero box so finally we saw you out earlier on the super stocker yep then you came back in yeah. and then you jumped on super the twin. super twin yeah. okay then you came back in and you were literally going from one bike to the other then you went out on this yeah. and then you've just been out on your rcv yeah. how do you calibrate your mind to go from or is it just yeah luck? um yeah basically they're all so different as well like the the bmw where uh, the s1000 that's like uh, a thing i've been used to for the last few years so um that that was quite easy to get on, and you know, it, to be fair, it's you know, good good setup on it, handling well, and then go on to uh, the 600. We only done uh, two laps, uh, 650. We only done two laps on that, so that took a bit of time to get going. But in the last sectors, I had some good last sectors. I think I went, you know, the fastest uh, on the last lap um, over the mountain and that. So you know, we had a bit of clutch slip on that as well. So we ended up fifth, but you know, we were happy with that, and uh, obviously then. We came and jumped on the Mugen and it's like all week I've been dreading today because of just you've only got one chance. I thought if the weather's bad or you know there's, there's so many things can go wrong. Like I was lucky with a bird strike, um, you know if that if it you know and broke the screen and something like that or some of the dash, you know uh, and there was birds coming at me from different directions, missing me. Because so. they can't hear you? Well, basically, yeah, because of the silence of the, the bike. Yeah, that's one thing a lot of people forget, I guess. Uh, just one final question. This is kind of becoming, fast becoming your event. Is this the bike that you want to be riding next season? Are we going to see you on the Oh, on definitely, the you know, if Mugen would have us back, yeah, I'd love to. Um, uh, I'm glad to get that win out of the way, like I said, and, um, you know, we were, you know, with John behind us as well, you know, John makes it extra more, special. More, it, it? it does, it does make it special. It, it hurt him, just, but I mean, you know, um, if he'd have beat me, if I'd have, I'd have given him a big hug. Fair play, fair play. Thank you for talking to us, Michael. Cheers. Congratulations, mate.